Gabriela Molina is a single mother in Puebla, Mexico, who says she lives in fear. Less than a month ago, her younger sister was brutally murdered, victim of a sexual assault. Her body was found on the side of the road. Because of the way my sister's body was found, at first sight, it was deemed a femicide. And as the newspapers reported, she had been strangled. Like many places in Mexico, Puebla is facing a crisis of gender-based violence that keeps personal safety in the back of every woman's mind. To help create awareness, the government has enlisted the help of over 170 tortilla shops across the state and wrap warm tortillas and pamphlets with information about femicide and a number to call if violence against women is suspected. This is a good thing and it benefits us all to help women be informed. Last month, a prosecutor in Veracruz was murdered outside her work. Some believe she was targeted because of her efforts to protect women and young girls. Still, experts believe impunity is the biggest obstacle against dampening the crisis. The problem, however, is also deeply ingrained in the culture. It's male privilege. Violence is a male privilege. Men kill each other on a daily basis, and men are also killing women because of their gender, because they believe women are worth less, or they believe that their lives belong to them. Protests denouncing violence against women are becoming more common in Mexico, which has among the highest rates of femicide on earth. The common slogan among demonstrations is not one more. Activists in Mexico have launched initiatives aimed at reducing levels of violence against women. Projects that include everything from gender workshops for cab drivers to interactive database maps like this one that track and catalog cases of femicide all over the country. Gabriela's sister was killed on November 11th. It was the 90th case of femicide this year. Since then, there have been five other women murdered in Puebla. Women shouldn't have to end up as a number or as some case file. Women have a face. We don't deserve to be killed or to be hurt or to be threatened or raped. Not one more. Not one more woman killed in Puebla or in Mexico or in the world. Manuel Rapalo, Al Jazeera. Puebla, Mexico.